New numbers from the Centers for Disease Control show more than half the country has a very high level of COVID-19 in their wastewater. Alex Little-Hales talked to the Sampton Road Sanitation District about our numbers. One's new and early tool for helping us navigate the COVID-19 pandemic, wastewater tracking has become a mainstay in tracking the coronavirus. And according to the Centers for Disease Control, Virginia ranks higher than the national average. It's not just medical experts pointing to an increase in COVID cases in Virginia. It's our own wastewater supporting that trend. It's much easier to look at this increasing sort of concentration of wastewater that we've seen since June at the national level and say, now that really does look like the beginning of a true sort of COVID peak. The Centers for Disease Control ranks Virginia as very high when looking at the amount of COVID-19 detected across the state's seven wastewater testing sites. For Kyle Curtis, environmental scientist with the Hampton Road Sanitation District, it's a data set that's even more accurate than hospital or Department of Health tracking. Wastewater data has always had that strength of it's just not biased by testing availability. Virginia's COVID rates are higher than the national average, but still below the southern region, just based on CDC tracking alone. These rates haven't been seen by wastewater sites since this February. But despite the state numbers, Curtis says this district has not seen a noticeable uptick either. It's unclear whether there is a delay in reporting a local surge in COVID cases or whether those COVID rates may be higher in other areas. In Norfolk, Alex Little-Hales for 13 News now. And in North Carolina, the COVID rates there tested in wastewater are more than 70% higher compared to Virginia.